Good evening. We begin with breaking news tonight. Within the last hour, 64% of machinists for Boeing in Washington State voted to reject the latest contract offer. And we also learned from a spirit spokesperson, regardless of the outcome, 700 spirit workers in Wichita are still being furloughed Monday. Tonight's offer would have given 33,000 Boeing machinists a 35% wage increase over four years and end the 41-day strike. KSN's Derek Lytle sat down with the Spirit Aerosystem spokesperson to learn what this means for people on the shop floor in Wichita. Derek. Yeah, Jeff, Julia, Spirit spokesperson Joe Bacino says because Boeing machinists turned down this contract offer, more drastic cuts could be coming. Unfortunately, due to a significant inventory uh, overstock on our 767 and 777 programs, we are moving forward with the furlough of approximately 700 Spirit teammates working on those programs. Spirit spokesperson Joe Pacino says this no vote means job losses could be coming. Should the strike continue beyond November 25th, uh, financial pressures and a significant inventory buffer will force additional measures for us, uh, more drastic furloughs certainly, and uh, layoffs of our teammates. Vecino says Spirit is taking additional steps, cutting travel, air shows, and other money-saving measures across the board. You know, given uh, the pressures here uh, that, that I've kind of described, uh, it's uh, it's a decision that became inevitable. It's decisions Pacino says are hard, and those conversations are now happening with employees at every level. With our teammates and their families, obviously that's tough. It's a tough moment as we come into the holidays. Our leadership uh, at all levels is talking to our, our uh, shop floor workers. I asked Pacino if uh, industry and spirit air systems are healthy moving into 2025 and beyond, and he told me he'd prefer to speak for the current moment. Here for you, Derek Lytle, KSN News 3. All right, Derek, thank you. The KB 